Ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is, guys. We are back here again today. Today, we're going to check out the top 10 most effective British adverts. All right, I'm not going to talk a lot, guys. We are just going to go straight to action and have fun with this one. Okay, hello, I'm a pizza. Ah, uh, okay, subscribe and like. Okay. Some of the ads featured in this countdown are extremely graphic and contain adult themes which some viewers may find upsetting or disturbing. Not for the faint-hearted, you have been warned. Okay, let's get it. I hope I won't understand it. I would feel like I might not understand it. Suspense. On your child's life, fire kills 2013. Last year in England. 15 children died in house fires. Children like yours. So parents, I'd like you to make a promise. Repeat after me. I swear on my child's life. To test my smoke alarm on clock change day. To give my family the best chance of surviving a house fire. You did promise, didn't you? Because you can't turn back time. Hmm. Oh. Oh, that was sad. He died in the fire. Okay, tree, St. John Ambulance. Um, you scooter? Oh, yeah. You know those ones where... Oh, hold on. Better get this, buddy. Hello, Martin. Wasn't expecting to hear from you today. Well, wasn't Steve supposed to be sorting that out on Friday? Okay, right. Right. Okay. <laughs> no, it's not a problem. Uh, Alice is one of thousands of St. John Ambulance volunteers. She's fully trained in first aid and knows what to do in any situation. Say something, buddy. She can be the difference between life and death. But what she can't do is be there every time. Briefly. He took his eyes off for two seconds, about two seconds, and that was all it took. I think every adult and every parent needs to learn the basics of first aid, or just learn first aid. Yeah, in fact, everyone should learn first aid as soon as you get to. Everyone should just learn it. Everyone should learn first aid. Like that would help a lot. But nah, yeah, this one was sad. Dead man talking, transfer for London, 2013. I could be at home now. Oh, I, I can tell you this with one. kids. Oh, I was thinking about going for a pint. Instead, I punched my lung. And it's slowly filling up with blood. I'm going into cardiac arrest now. <laughs> Silly place to overtake, really. Still, you live and learn. 
ったね。Shall I story motor neuron disease association 2009? Now you know how it feels to get motor neurone disease. Help us fight back. Is that how it is? Is that how it really is? This is so scary. It is so scary. I can't imagine anyone going through this. It's so agonizing. Me just watching, I felt the agony in this one. Life story, Bernardo's 2013. Do you want to just um, come through, take a seat? Uh, do you want tea or coffee or anything? I'm all right for the time being, thank you. Okay. You look really well, yeah. what have you been up to? Lots of rock climbing, lots. <laughs> that sounds good. So, how's life these days? Yeah, things are <coughs> good. Yeah. Got a job, got a girlfriend, got a little boy. Mm. Never let him go for what I went through. Still having the nightmares though. My anger's under control. I trust people more. I'm getting a bit better now. You know, it's like I can see a way out. That one for Bernardo's is all right. He changed. Talk a lot. And I trust her. Everyone else could just do one. Women from Bernardo's doesn't give up. Keeps asking why I nick stuff. Do drugs, hit people. I told her where to go. Told my foster parents where to go. Just like the last ones. Don't trust no one. I ain't changing. <laughs> Multiple personality disorder, is it? Or what is this? They loved to be at the bus stop. Said I was thick. Might say that again. Mummy's boyfriend hates me. I tried hard, but he always finds me. I'm scared. Child abuse, that's what it is. I am a crisis, British Red Cross, 2012. I am the fire that leaves you homeless. A harsh attack in aisle six. The prescription you cannot collect. I am the boiled sweet stuck in your child's throat. The motorway pileup that leaves you traumatized. The food shopping you cannot do. I'm the reason you need a wheelchair. The flood that leaves you stranded. The empty house when you return from hospital. I am a crisis. And I don't care who you are.
Help plus St. John's St. John Ambulance 2012. I think he's choking. He needs to try and come. Okay, okay, because he's asking. Just come over there. How long are they going to be? They'll be here in five minutes. Five. They need to be there now. Well, then, if it's nothing, you just push him off. I don't know. Oh, you don't know. Oh, my God. Don't stop there. Don't stop there. Don't stop there. Don't stop this one this one hit me yeah this one hit me hard he won the fight over the cancer but to survive when he was choking all he needed was first aid he fought the hard fight the hard one he fought it but all he needed was first aid and he choked we need to learn first aid I'm going to make it a priority. I need to learn that thing. You can save a life. Free Break the Circle, Bernardo's 2008 Piccadilly Circus. Oh, Circle of Abuse. Oh, what is it? Yeah, they've let you out again, have they? You worthless little cow. Come on then. I don't know what it says, alright? You okay? Here, here, 20 quid. Mom, you Mom! You worthless little cow. I don't know what it says. Here, 20 quid. Give me the money! You worthless little cow. I don't know what it says. Here, 20 quid. Money! Worthless. It says 20 quid. Money! Worthless. It says 20 quid. Money! Worthless. For thousands of children in the UK, the story will keep repeating itself until someone stops it. To torture by any other name. Ellen Bamba Association, 2007, London Eye. Elena didn't think anyone would hurt her. Elena trusted everyone. Maria doesn't trust anyone. Elena wanted to learn English. Maria gets beaten if she says no. Elena worked in a market to support her family. Maria works for nothing. Elena wanted to help people and be a nurse. Maria services up to 40 men a day. Elena used to cry when her father was cross with her. Maria doesn't feel anything anymore. Elena's family thinks she's dead. Help me. I was Elena. I am Maria. Help me. I'm 
from here. Women enslaved by sex trafficking lose more than just their names. Trafficking is torture. Number one, if London were Syria, save the children, 2014. Happy birthday to you! Make a wish. Hello. Have you done your homework? Adam! Ready or not? Here it comes! Violent clashes with British. Five ammunition again. You deserve to get shot. Have a nice day, Sam. Air strikes on rebel position. We are going to stay. Tabby! Go! <laughs> So it's basically if London were Palestine, just because it isn't happening here doesn't mean it isn't happening. Talk about effectiveness. Save Syria's children. Talk about effectiveness. Wow. These adverts, they hit the point home. I'm subscribed. I'm definitely subscribed. Yeah, I was saying these adverts, they hit the point home. Like nothing could be more straightforward more clear than this nothing could nothing could give you more feelings like this nothing could, could get you more emotionally involved very well made very well uh, executed the storylines were amazing the production was beautiful well shot the transitions were just just wonderful this is just amazing well done well done this is how an advertisement should be this is the real definition of adverts okay it gets you emotionally involved gets you emotionally charged you feel it you go through the emotions yeah it puts you in the feels and you don't even need much convincing you're like you know what i feel this i get the message very loud and clear because i felt it in my heart and my soul as well wow okay well done, well done. Whew. Almost putting me in my feels, you know. Yeah. Ooh. Ah. Got me emotional. <laughs> All right, guys. Peace out.